Well, he is perhaps the most underrated middleweight contender at present. Here is Poland's Chris Jocko back for another go. This man has some of the most punishing kicks in the division. And his game really has only been sharpened under the tutelage of Dean Thomas and the crew at American Top Team in South Florida. He's also got that takedown defense on point to keep the fight upright if that is what he chooses to do tonight. This guy is a wrestler, and wrestling is perhaps the most important aspect of mixed martial arts because the wrestler, if he has control over his opponent, can dictate where the fight takes place. He is the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee, outstanding striker, very dynamic on the feet, so unpredictable, great combination of precision and timing. And Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Bruce Lee is nothing if not adaptable, perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. This next guy has incredible takedowns. Both timing, speed, and of course, technique are literally top of the food chain. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Three years apart, some differences in height and reach as well. Now to get a start of the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> a Greco Roman wrestler, winning a professional record of 19 wins or losses. He stands 6 feet 1 inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, Chris Jocko! And now he is his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, get the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a Ready? long time, and it Ready? is going to go down go. right now. Here we go. All right, another big spot for Chris Jocko here tonight as we get ready to go in round one. A lot of people envision him as a future UFC middleweight champion. Needs to get off to a good start here tonight. Not unlike he did, of course, in knocking out Camden McCrory in less than a minute back in 2016. Jocko and his camp have really emphasized round one. We'll see if he can follow suit and start quickly here tonight. Oh, and he connects there. All right, so here we go with round one, and you gotta be mindful of those overhand punches if you're his opponent. You know it's a big part of his game plan every time out. It's his go-to punch. We'll see if he can find a home for it here tonight. Oh, effective use of the jab by Lee. And he eats a right hand there. Nice right hand to the body. So more output, at least in the early going. Very rare technique. You don't see too many guys throwing that side kick. Right hook attempt. That's a miss. And there's a nice jab. 
And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Kick lands for him there. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Jotko. Misses with the right hand. Nice front kick to the body. Chotko going for the leg kick. Nothing doing that. That's there. a nice clean shot. Just over three minutes to go round one. Banjo, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You got to get that head off the center line. Oh, high level stuff as he counters with that right hand. Big punches. Missed that shot. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. He caught the kick. Catches the leg there, but then lets it go. No harm, no foul. Nice. Leg kick checked by Lee. Just misses there with the left. Jab. Hook attempt now blocked, though, by Jotka. Oh, he just missed with that straight left hand, Joe. Two minutes on the round one clock. That leg kick lands. Nice jab there by Lee. There's that kick. Nice shot. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. He just whips that punch in. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. No, oh, the left leg goes high. Finds his range with the jab. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding yeah, up. Yeah, it's, it's freak. It's like he's cheating. You know, it's like he's got rocks in his gloves. High kick. Oh, that head kick landed. Lee going for the head kick here, but no setup whatsoever, Joe, so nothing doing. Nice kick landed there by Chuck. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Oh, nice strike landed there by Jotko. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, that punch will count, landed flush. That's a really strong leg kick there by Jotko. Oh, nice. Jotko gets tagged again, another flush punch to the head. Final seconds of round one. Horn sounds push. for the oh. end of round one. It's punching with that punch this one. Right? He has no answer for your punch. He's not defending the right way. He's open for those knees, those elbows. All of that is working great. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. Here we see an excellent kick. Connects flush with perfect timing. Very impressive striking going on in that round. Brittany Palmer with us. Okay, round two, you ready? You ready? All right, round two. All right, so second round getting underway now. Not a bad first round. Both fighters had their moments. Looked like at times they were just getting warmed up a little bit, perhaps a little bit of a feeling out process over that first minute. What's your thoughts on what we saw there in that first round? Nice kick there by Chaka. Nice job. 
job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Lee. Both men landing in that exchange. Great kicks there. Total strikes. Also, he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. Good punch. Shot goes kick to the body here. That one appeared to be blocked. Well, Joe, he did not connect there. Oh, big right hand, yes. Caught that one. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Front kick to the face. Oh, how clean is that jab by Jocko? Unable to connect with the right hand there. Slightly deflected. Just misses with that one. Watch the punch. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, nicely done with the head kick. Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Look at that. Nice. Oh, he missed that kick. Nice jab. Oh, slips to avoid the right. He tagged him with that right hand. Lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice defense there, huge block. They're both landing bombs on each other. Look at that nasty jab. Inside leg kick. Shotgo's facial cut is getting worse now, Joe. Man, is that thing flossing. Good blood. shot. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Nice leg kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. That shot blocked by Jocko. That one hurts. Nice one, two there. Huge block there. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. And a nice kick. Well, you gotta start to change things up here defensively. Again, he gets clipped to the head, and again, he's vulnerable by leaning right into his opponent's range. Nice inside leg kick. Good kicks there by Chuck. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. 30 seconds to go in this one. Jocko gets hit by that kick to the body. Misses a huge hook to the head. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Lee gets caught with that punch. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Final seconds here of round two. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse. Let's take a look at it again here. Here it is from another angle. Perfectly placed strike here, lands on target. 
excellent striking on display in that round. Ariane Celeste on hand. Next round underway, and you have to admire just how fresh these guys look, Joe. You know, both have made a concerted effort to improve their cardiovascular conditioning over the last several months, and it's paying dividends here on Fight Night. We see a lot of guys with hands on their knees in between rounds. If body language is any indication, both of these fighters have plenty left. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Set up behind it, the right hook misses. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Pretty strong leg kick there, Joe, by Chuck. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. Oh, beautiful technique for him there on that side kick. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Oh! Wow. Well, he walked into his opponent's range there and ate that hook. He was unprotected, unguarded, and he's been susceptible to that hook in previous UFC fights. Got to figure out a way to move those feet and ultimately circle out and get that head off the center line. Connects with the punch there. And there he swung with a haymaker. Lee gets hit with a kick. That looked like it hurt you. And lands a good shot. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Oh, very nice. Oh, right hook attempt. No good. Just out of range with that strike. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Oh! Oh, the straight hand lands flush to the body by Lee. Just reached the midway point of the fight. Oh! Nice punch by Chaka. Huge kick misses. Well, I'm not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Jocko gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. Under two minutes now to go in our third round. Great exchanges. Oh, that's a good right hand. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Exactly. Effective use of the jab there by Lee. Just misses with the jab there. Unable to connect with a right hook. Nice punch there by Jocko. This cut in his face is getting worse. Oh, there's the kick right underneath the elbow. Nice punch there by Lee. That one hurts. Oh, how about the multiple strikes landing here? That is a serious offensive barrage. Missed with that right hand. Lee's kick is blocked. He landed that punch flush. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Ooh, tagged him. And a miss with the right hook. Fifth 
15 seconds to go. Whiffs on the right hand. Beautiful uppercut there. That's right, three rounds in the can. We're up. headed to the championship round. All right, that is the end of the round, and the cut on his lip has gotten really, really bad. And at this point, you at least have to ask the question as to whether or not it's affecting his breathing. I think if this cut gets any worse, the doctor's going to have no choice but to step in, protect the fighter, and stop the fight. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. Are you ready? Are you ready? Fourth round now, fight schedule for five five minute rounds. All right, next round is underway, and I'm excited to see it, Joe Rogan. Pretty good round for both guys the last time out. Now we'll see if one fighter or another can really take control of this fight. Both fighters have been aggressive, but also defensive. We'll see how they approach this next round and try to really put this fight in their favor. He's fainting with that kick. Oh, useful, well-placed kick there. Oh, he found the target there, Joe. Nice punch. Looking for the left hook. for that right hand. Let me show you the total strikes. Oh, and he goes up top of the kick. Oh, wow. He's got him right here. He tagged him again. Oh, big left. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches and punches, and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Nice. How about that chin? Just misses with the straight left hand. Three minutes now to go in this one. Well, he stayed committed to the body work, and the results are there, Joe. Look at the right side of his body. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Leg kick checked effectively there by Jocko. Well, he got clipped to the body there, Joe. Left his midsection wide open. He's become a little bit susceptible to that shot by almost leaning in, moving into his opponent's offense. Not a good look there. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. A front kick to the face! And now he lands a combination! He's got to be careful here. He hurt him with that hook. Chop goes hook shot blocked though by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Lands a strike there. Just missed with the left there. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, rips the body shot there. Chotko gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Just missing on the uppercut there. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, we got tagged! Chotko going for the head kick, and he misses there. Nice 
nice axe kick. Misses again with a right punch. Lee's cut is just bleeding like mad. I wouldn't be surprised at this point, Joe, to see the referee call in the doctor. And if he gets a close look at that thing, he's probably going to stop this fight. And he lands the roundhouse. Nice. Just missed with the straight left hand. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Well, he left the body wide open there, Joe. He's vulnerable to that straight punch. If he's going to move forward and keep his body and his head on that center line, he's going to pay for it. He certainly did there. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Ten seconds to go in round four. That was a big left hand. Maybe he threw that with every ounce of his being. Man, what a round, what a round. Let's take a look at some of the actions in this round. Here's a huge kick that stuns. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. There's a powerful kick to the body. Listen, he's out striking us, okay? So, just... Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste. All right, last round, you ready? You ready? Fifth so and final round. Wow, that left high kick came out of nowhere. A oh, hook to the head by Jocko. Out of range with that one. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. He blocks the shot. Jocko's eye and the swelling around it is only getting worse by the minute. You gotta wonder, Joe, at this point, whether or not that might be a fractured orbital bone. Looping left hand misses the target. Nice inside leg kick. Leg kick checked nicely by Lee. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed it flush. So let's see if he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. He's a, a nice right hand. How about that shin? Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Tagged him. Again. One to the body. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. He gets caught with that punch. Excellent axe kick. And he connects there. Some nice deception there as he lands the hook. Very good job of timing these shots here. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Finds a home for the left hand there. Whoa! This could be it! threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Body kick, look at that. Oh, there he connected. That was a nice jab. And another kick. So clock starting to become a factor here. Just misses with the jab. And he connects with the punch. Good exchange there.
Two minutes and counting to go in this fight. Shot goes cut on his nose, manageable for a while, maybe not so much now. That thing is pouring blood. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Just missing on the counter there. Very nice leg kick there by Chaka. He's limping. He appears to be injured. That one hurt. Nice punch by Chaka. I right, check that leg kick, Joe. One minute to go in the fight. Gets home. Hook shot with the hook. Hole. Thirty seconds now to go in the fight. He's checking every single one of those. Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a welt on his opponent. Strong straight left there. Joe, nice head movement there to slip that right hand. Well-placed kick there by Chopko. Oh, he just misses with the right hook there, Joe. What a fight! All right, so this one will go to a decision, and this one might receive some bonus money as well. Close fight. Both fighters went toe-to-toe -to -toe in the center of the octagon. A lot of significant strikes landed on both sides. We are very curious to see how the judges saw this one. Round four, look at the torque in this kick. Absolutely perfect technique. Lands very cleanly. And here in the final round, look at this beautiful kicking technique on display. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 48-47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Chris Chappell! All right, so there he is, your winner by decision here tonight. He certainly had to work hard for it at times, and he earned this UFC win, arguably the biggest of his octagon tenure. And now it's going to be interesting to see how they matchmake him moving forward. This, I think.